Good morning, guys. It's carry the one Tuesday. Well, well, well. It's day one of two of my days off in a row. <laughs> Already got up this morning and uh, walked the lasers. Free walked him because now he walks right alongside me or within the direct per uh, perimeter of me. He's outside now enjoying himself, I hope. Let's see. Yeah, he is. Still whining. He wants to be near me, but he's got to be outside. He's been in this kennel too long. So today, I have a couple of things in my midst of plans. I want to fix the leak that I have in my Blackwater valve. The leak is, like, like I told y'all weeks ago, I think I did. So many vlogs since then. It's related to... The leak is related to the 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 uh, flange on the back. It's just cracked, and a whole section back there needs to be replaced. But I don't have the money, so I'm just gonna patch it, just like everything else, guys. Y'all know the routine. It's what I do. So flushing out the tank three or four times, and then I will proceed to get up under there very carefully uh, with all the safety gear, glasses which I already have, gloves, and proceed to start to fix the leak. I'm going to let it sit for a little bit because I want it to dry out. Then I'll take that silicone off of there and put that uh, JB water weld under there and hopefully that'll fix it guys. Hopefully that'll fix it. But other than that, let's see what else I got on plan today. Uh, I'm going to seal up my vents, uh, my dirt dauber vents today. I would like to do some other videos today too that I have a long list of videos I need to do guys. So I'd like to do some of that today too. So today is pretty much going to be camper fixes, YouTube videos type stuff. And then tomorrow what I want to do is I want to get up and I want to go hiking with my little buddy and do some geocaching and then go to church in the evening. So that's the plan. We'll try to prepare everything today. Oh, the other thing I have to do today too is that I have to wash clothes. I've had clothes in the bucket soaking for a week. <laughs> so they're well soaked. And I'm going to go ahead and wash those and get those hung up. Once I get the uh, toilet rinsed out here. And get those on the dry cycle and start washing some more clothes. And laundry today, camper fixes, videos, YouTube. That's my, my gist today. What you guys are seeing right now is little Acer's outside, chewing on a stick. Hello, baby. I see you talking about me, baby. Hello, everybody. I'm excited. You're doing some food and doing a little stick. But yeah, he seems to like chewing sticks. So what I do is I get him a stick, put it out there, and he'll sit there and chew on it for about 15 minutes or so to kind of keep his attention. But yeah. That's what he likes. A tide, boss. A tide. I have been working like a little busy bee today. My little Bubba Easters has been out with me today. And uh, let me show y'all guys what I've done. So I was able to get my vents all screened in. And I did the exact same thing over here with my refrigerator vent. Got everything screened in. And I just applied the JB water weld 
here and we'll see if that actually works for me at all keeping the leaks out I went up on the roof just to see if I could actually put a vent on the AC cover but that's a, another time another deal oh let me show you what else I did here I also went in and siliconed around the exhaust vent for the the heater just so that the dirt daubers can't get up under this uh, insect vent so it's been a pretty busy day I'm dirty filthy I need to go take a shower once I do that I'll be fine but I got my little bubba eaters here Really? Crap! Somebody else is going to the house. Guys, I BS you not. There was an ambulance that just went down the road. This is the second time. Tulsa. Show y'all guys something. Didn't notice this till like maybe 30 minutes ago. What are these prints on my car? Is that raccoon or what is that? I don't think they go anywhere else. I think they just go to the front. I didn't see any on the back. Yeah, looks like he, whatever it was, came up, changed his mind, and then went back down. No idea what it could have been. So I can see now, whoever it is, they're taking them into the helicopter now. It's one person. I don't know what the issue is, guys, but they were taking their happy time getting them over here. Gonna have to find somebody that knows something, what's going on. So. Yes, sir, buddy. This is the excitement in Mayberry. Got a load of clothes, son. Actually, two loads of clothes. Now I'm gonna go up to, oh, I got my clothes ready to go take my shower, so I gotta go to the state park, take my shower, turn this light out, come back here. Hopefully, a lot of that will be dry, probably not. Let's close this door, turn this light out. <laughs> so far, guys, so far, the uh, black water leak, black water valve leak is working. I used all but one single drop of JB Weld on that leak. That's how bad that flange was behind it. But I'm probably gonna have to cut that SOV off next time around. So, been a busy day, guys. I put the screens up. On all my, uh, on all my, put the screens up, my bug screens up, on all my doors that needed it. I washed two loads of clothes. I 
hope I seal the black water valve leak. I'm going to go take a shower. Tomorrow I have to do more loads of clothes. I would like to get my screen door done tomorrow, but I don't have the tool that I need, the screen door thingamajiggy. So I gotta get that Friday. Once I get that, then I'll be able to do my screen door. Once I do my screen door, I'll do my seal, seal some other doors and stuff, and then we might be slowing down. One of the reasons why, guys, that y'all have not seen me hiking is because I have spent my entire time fixing this. This has been a humongous portion of my time, guys, this RV. And I would love, tomorrow I wanted to go hiking with Acers on a trail, but it doesn't look like I'm going to be able to because i got to get stuff done before I go back to work. Because when I go back to work, I won't have time to do stuff. So, but let me get stuff in the car, and me and Acers are going to head out to uh, Arrowhead State Park to go take a shower. I am anyway. He's going to sit in the car and wait. My little buddy here scared his dad very much earlier today about an hour ago i came out here and saw his harness just sitting here and he was gone i went out here asked the two boys that were playing basketball out there and they seen him and they said they saw him earlier sound like a friday movie right earlier debo earlier you seen craig earlier um i looked out here and he was way over here on the other side of the street and the only way I knew it was him, I didn't have my glasses on, I saw a little black and white spot over it, I knew that was him. So, I went over there and got him, brought him back, and this is what I've done to kind of prevent that from happening again. Now, very well, if he really wanted to get out, he could, he's going to choke himself. But, stop Aces, come here. I don't want to hurt you, Bubba, I just want to show people what we got here. So, if you look on his harness here, he's got a loop on his harness. Now, the reason why is because this is a little too big for him. He's actually smaller than this harness. So he can actually back out of this if he wanted to. And that's what he did. So what I did here is I put a carabiner on his harness here and the other part on his, on his uh, collar here. So if he backs out of this, he may back out of the harness, but he's gonna have to back out of this leash and that's pretty tight on his, well not pretty tight. He'll have to really wanna be out of that. He can get out of it if he wants to, but he's going to have to really want to. It ain't going to feel good. So, hopefully that'll keep him from scaring me again. Take a little H's for a walk. Show you all that beautiful skyline. That beautiful Oklahoma skyline. And that's up, guys. Can't beat it. Can't beat it with a stick, guys. A tide, boss. A tide. Morning. Silly little puppy. Oh. It's nice and cool out here this evening, guys. It's 5 o'clock. I think it's dark at 6, so it's about 5, 5 o'clock-ish. Come on, Ace. Let's go. Another beautiful day at home. You just can't beat it. Uh, so tired. I just realized I hadn't eaten anything since this morning. I had two peanut butter and jelly sandwiches this morning. <clears throat> and it's 6 o'clock, so I uh, fixed me one bowl of noodles. That wasn't enough. I ate me a can of carrots. That wasn't enough. And I'll give her to make another bowl of noodles. Hopefully that'll do her. Oh, I'm so tired. I go take the shower, come back. Little Acers is, I don't know if y'all can see him or not. He's pretty much done for the night. Mail time. So, we are headed to the state park so I can get a shower. My little bottle acers with me. And that is the status, guys. I am pooped. Of course, I've said that a number of times so far on this Wednesday. But, hey, it is what it is, guys. 
just got to keep pushing forward. I am learning to become stronger. Shower done. Time to head to the house.